What's up guys and welcome back to the Johnny Q channel. Thanks for watching. In this video, I review my subscribers everyday carry gun setup. So about a couple of weeks ago, I put out on my YouTube community tab to have you guys, my viewers, my subscribers, to email me your everyday carry gun setups. And let me tell you, you guys emailed me and emailed me and emailed me where I, I just got a ton of emails of people's everyday carry guns and I was like, at some point, I just thought, okay, stop, stop emailing me. This is that video today. So without further ado, let's get into it. But first, I feel like it's appropriate to show you my current everyday carry setup right now, which is right here. And this is it, the Glock 19 Gen 5 with a Trijicon RMR red dot optic. And it's holstered in this Profile Plus holster by Tolster. I've been using this holster for the last, I mean, it's been a little bit, but uh, I love this holster. It is the best, sleekest, thinnest profile holster that I that I carry, and it's just the best. So if you wanna go check these guys out, go to tolster.com and use my code JQ15 for 15% off your entire order or the Profile Plus or whatever you guys are wanting to get on the website my gift to you, JQ15. And of course, for privacy reasons, I'm not going to name all the people that sent me an email of a picture of their everyday carry just for safety reasons. So gun number one we have is this, it looks like a P365. Uh, this person says, this is my truck slash CCW, SIG P365 macro, uh, Tay cops, to cops. I probably should know what that is, but I don't know what that is. I'm not gonna lie to you. I've never, I've not seen to cops. I sound like an idiot, <laughs> so I apologize. But yeah, that's a sweet setup. I also love rocking the uh, X Macro. It is a very, very awesome everyday carry. Holds so many rounds. It's all, it's also compact and it's just great. So, congrats. All right, person number two here. We have this guy. Uh, he sent me a picture of this. It looks like the Springfield Armory Echelon. Uh, yeah, that looks like the Echelon. You have a nice, is that a Benchmade knife? No, that is, that's something. Snako, something. Nice knife there. Uh, got the magazine. I love to see those rounds in there. No ball ammo. And then of course you have this G GYA, CYA holster. I can't really read that and then a brown wallet. So yeah, I mean, I'm surprised that you're every day carrying the Springfield Armory Echelon because that's a big boy. Uh, also, get an optic on your guns, guys, get an optic. But anyway, very good setup, love that. Love that you have all the rounds and you are carrying a full-sized gun because why not? All right, person number three here. Heck yeah, dude, that's a great gun. Look, you got that Extendo magazine on there. That is a big boy. And then you got your holster up here. Yeah. Um, do you guys like the uh, the two metal prong? I honestly don't know if I like those metal prongs on my holster, which is why I switched out the Profile Plus from Tolster to that metal, or from the metal clips to the plastic clip, but that's just my opinion. But yeah, it looks like you got the CZ P10 here. I, I've actually have not shot that gun, but I've heard really good things about it. And if, hey, if you're everyday carrying it and you train with it and you're comfortable with it, heck yeah, dude, love it. Keep on carrying, love it. All right, up next we do have, oh, this looks very familiar because this is honestly one of my setups, the Glock 43X MOS. I don't have the MOS version, although I would like to have the MOS version at some point, with the Hollow Sun 407K optic chambered in nine mil, but also holstered in a 945 Industries bag. And you guys know me, if you watch this channel, I love all things 945 Industries bag. It is one of the best everyday carry bags you can holster and carry your gun in. In my opinion, you can also draw insanely fast from, from the position up here on the chest. So what an awesome setup. Uh, going from a reflex sight to a closed emitter sight changed my life. So if you can get to a closed emitter sight, you will forever love. Love that closed emitter red dot. So anyway, awesome setup, very, very nice. Okay, up next we do have, 
<laughs> I just opened this for the first time. That is actually freaking hilarious. Uh, this person submitted their everyday carry, and it's uh, the Glock Banana. Well, that's awesome. Congratulations. At least, you know, I, I guess if Bowser is behind you, you can just slip that banana, and he can slip on the banana peel. Cool. <laughs> All right, up next we have, ooh, look at this. We have a pair of Glocks, the two Glockies. It looks like we have a Glock, let's see here, a Glock 43X, non-MOS, with a nightstick TSM 11G light. I've not tried that light. Let me know how you like it. And then, of course, we have the Glock. What is this? 19? What is that? What is that? But you have a TLR1 HL Streamlight on there. I want to say that looks like a 19, but I probably know. That back strap is... Mm, mm, iron sights, non-MOS, only rear serrations. Is that just a... I honestly, I can't tell what that is. But I know it's a Glock. Uh, and it looks like you have an extended magazine on there, which for those of you who are rocking the extended magazine, do you like that as you carry every day? Is that something you guys like normally do? I don't rock the extended magazine, but hey, I could be swayed to, to carry an extended magazine. But yeah, that's a pretty good setup. Uh, I hope you're not dual wielding both of those on a daily basis. You just need one, but hey, awesome setup. Just make sure you go out and train with both of those guns. All right, up next, let's see here. Oh. <laughs> All right, again, I just opened this one for the first time, but we have the Magyar 12.7 millimeter. That just looks like it, it could literally destroy a mummy that rose back from the dead. So that's that's cool. That's, that's quite the everyday carry you got there, my guy. <laughs> Oh, dude. <laughs> and I think that's the perfect way to end it. The Mummy Killer ends it today. So if you guys want me to do more of these videos, please let me know down below. Maybe I'll do a video of me reviewing your your battle rifle or like truck gun kind of thing. More so a rifle than, you know, 9mm pistol for everyday carry. I did have tons and tons of submissions from you guys, the viewers, my subscribers. Thanks for watching. Thanks for being a subscriber. Thanks for emailing me. I can't get through all of them, but it was fun making this video. I feel like I could have reviewed more guns, but again, so many submissions and this would just be one hour video, which might be too long on this subject. Um, but anyway, thanks so much for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next Johnny Q video. Peace.